it has been a tough time for me and my family and um, I would really love for your support when you're when you're young you do crazy things you're so impulsive and I'm so guilty of it I know being young is not an excuse but I just want to apologize for being guilty of my nudes of my nudes collection yes yes I have a lot of it did I get you? Maganda ba yung acting ko? Ah, hindi ako napag cry. I was trying to cry on you, but hindi ako si Marcel Soriano. Yan, guilty ako of collecting my nudes. Ito sila. Okay, enough na yung acting acting na yan. True value. Back to Buya mode. Let us be Kenkoy again. I don't want that hassle drama. No. No, guys, I don't have any nude leaks. None whatsoever. If may pagli leak man na nudes, eto yan. Yung mga lipstick na to, yan yung magli leak. Pero, guys, wale po, wale. Okay, yung mag unsubscribe, please. Kailangan kayo yung subscription nyo sa channel ko. Para tayo ay mag grow, grow, grow. Boo fam, let us grow bigger and larger as a virtual family. Ayan. <sighs> Parang ang bigat ng heart ko nun ah. Kanina sa acting ko. Well, the Oscar goes to Blue. Blue. I need to do a close-up so that you will see my lips better. So the first product I have right now is the NYX Cosmic Metals in the shade Retro Harmony. Ang ganda ng, ano, ganda ng shade name, Retro Harmony. I love it. So, hindi siya matte finish at all. It, for me, it doesn't look metallic. It looks more of like shimmer, ganun siya. Ayan, basta, yun nga, yung consistency niya, may pagka-glossy, although a lot thicker. Sa mga nag-e-expect dyan ng matte ko, hindi matte yung next Cosmic Metals, may pagka-glossy yung consistency. So, I think they tried to make it metallic by using shimmer ingredients, but hindi na pull off yung pagka-metallic. Naging shimmer siya for me. Okay, so next we have is the NYX Liquid Suede. So, I actually have two shades of NYX Liquid Suede that I'm gonna swatch. One is the Sandstorm, and the other one is the shade Soft Spoken. Yung NYX Liquid Suede, ito yung kind of formula na favorite talaga ni Robbie D. Christie. At madami pang makeup artists, ma mahilig sila sa suede. Madaming nagagandahan sa formula. And even me, maganda siya kasi napaka ang flexible niya sa lips mo. Well, when I mean na flexible yung liquid lipstick, pag nag-smile ka, when you do like that, hindi nakikita na ka-crack siya. Um, kasi hindi siya like super dry na liquid matte lipstick. Kampante ako na hindi siya magka-crack. Ganon siya ka-flexible and comfortable sa lips. Hindi siya super matte kung mag-set. And when, when I press my lips, ayan, napaka-sticky niya. It does set matte. Y yun nga yung weird. Nagsiset siya ng matte. But it, it still feels very much tacky. Hindi siya kagaya ng ibang matte liquid lipsticks na pag nag-swipe ka ng lips mo, hindi siya magta-transfer. Pero ito magta-transfer talaga. Ayan. If you can see the transfer. Ayan. I have two shades of lip lingeries with me. I have the shade Lace Detail and Honeymoon. Sa lahat ng packaging ng mga lipis ko ever, yung favorite ko na packaging, ito yung lip lingerie. It's, it's so cute. Right now, first I am gonna swatch this. So first I am gonna swoop. What is up with me and the word swatch today? Okay, first, some lip lingerie. I am gonna swatch the shade lace detail. Actually, I'm not a big fan of lace detail. So, yeah, guys, I don't like wearing this. I really hate it. Parang kumain ako ng cake, tapos yung icing nag-stop lang dyan sa lips ko, tapos iyon na siya. Iyon na yung glam look ko, yung icing on my lips. In fairness, mahirap siyang tanggalin sa ano, sa makeup wipe remover. Gabi, ang hirap. 
Let's proceed to Kahi Doll. I have here the Nude Me Liquid Lip Matte in the shade Nude Brown. So I also like this kind of nude shade because the color is super similar to the shade of Sandstorm. It's not like liquid suede, it's not like lip lingerie that it's been set for a long time. This one has set it right now. Then when I press my lips together, it's not sticky feeling. It's a powdery feeling. So if you're into that kind of formulation, then this is perfect for you. And what I also like about this liquid lipstick is that the applicator is yung shape niya parang paa or if you're a ballet dancer or if you know ballet dancers um, have you seen like the toe shoes? yan yung itsura ng, ng applicator niya parang toe shoe siya ang saya ng feeling sa lips kasi parang minamassage na yung lips mo while applying the lipstick so it's a nice touch to it it's not moisturizing at all compared to the liquid suede and lip lingerie's but it doesn't feel heavy you can just feel the top layer na may my very a very thin layer of powdery feeling. Yun nga lang sa formula ng Kaki Doll or similar sa formula ng Kaki Doll. Pag madaming lip movements, when your lips return to its normal state, nakikita yung creases ng lips. Yan yung mga reasons bakit um, natatanggal yung lipstick agad or parang mukha ng lips mo napaka jiting na kasi um, yun, sa lip movements yun, nakikita yung crease ng lips. The last set of nude lippies that I'm gonna swatch are from Colorette. I've got one Lick Lacquer Ultimate and two Supra Mattes. So first, I'm gonna apply the Lick Lacquer in the shade Mono. Hindi siya kagaya ng Kathy Doll. When I pressed my lips kanina with Kathy Doll, wala na talaga ang feeling ng tackiness or stickiness. But ito, mayroong very very subtle hint of tackiness dito sa um, Lick Lacquer na to. Actually, yesterday pala, I did an arm swatch test from 10.30 a.m. to 5.30 p.m. Unfortunately, this one, hindi siya gaano ka long wearing. Next siya sa liquid suede na tanggal. So, eto na erase agad sa kamay ko. Para siyang copy doll and liquid suede na ginanon, mash up together into this kind of formula. Um, it's not that matte. It's not that sticky. It's moisturizing, it sets matte. I don't know, basta ganun siya. Sadly, for this one, for Mono, it is not ultra pigmented. Hindi talaga siya pigmented, guys. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Colorette, I love you! Please, please don't hate on me! Yung pigmentation niya, parang nag-glaze on na ako ng matte once. Parang it's just a glaze of matte. Am I making sense? My lips are still peeking through with this one. But, 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 the next batch naman of Colorette, bumawi sila ng todo, 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 todo to the max. Eto, tsaka yung Kathy Doll sa arm swatch ko, yung Colorette and Kathy Doll, sila yung nagtagal ng super, super matagal. So, I have the shade Eli and Reed. This, this is the bomb.com. Like, my world, I was shook at. I was shook at when I first tried it on. Parang, yung toothpaste, sa lips mo, yan yung parang yung minty feeling. Ganun siya. I love that feeling talaga. So, yun nga. Uh, dry na siya. So, it is indeed mattest of all mats, but it's that kind of mat na it's hindi siya drying. Kagaya na mono, yung formulation na to, medyo may pagka coffee doll mixed with NYX liquid spray. Transfer proof. So, yan. Transfer, transfer proof. Nothing, nothing at all. And also, it's also full coverage. Hindi na ako nag dip again sa tube. I just took the applicator, applied it on my lips. Hindi na ako nag dip again. Ayun na siya. Definitely full coverage, not like the lip lacquer. Super big thumbs up for Supra Matte. <sighs> Even when I'm inhaling. I feel the mintiness. It's so good. It's so good. Meron pa pala kong last lip to swatch and that is Colourpop Ultra Matte Lip in the shade Monday. So, yan guys. I thought before, pag Colourpop, maganda yung formula. Bakit? 
Bakit? Bakit nag-disappointed ka? Why Colourpop? Why you do this? Madami nag-rave about Colourpop, but bakit for me, ang pangit talaga niya. Palagi ako nag-re-retouch pag ginagamit ko to until I stopped wearing it na. Every time I wear this, napapacheck ako sa mirror kasi meron palang times na napupunta yung brittled parts ng lipstick na to. Napupunta siya sa ngipin ko, guys. I don't like Colourpop. I'm just gonna say it out loud. I don't like Colourpop. I like their other products, but yung hype about Ultra Matte Lip, I don't get it. I just don't. Tapos yung packaging pa niya, nag-fade na agad. Mabilis talaga yung mag-fade yung packaging niya. Which is a bummer kasi, di ba? Ang ganda sana ng packaging niya. Napaka-sleek. Tapos, what happened? Nawala na yung logo ng Colourpop. Nag-fade na lahat. So ugly! So freaking ugly! Don't like it! Me don't like it! Ah, it's horrible! It really is horrible on the lips! Oh my gosh! I don't like it! This is the formulation of lipstick. When you have a lot of lip movements, smiling, pouting, laughing, it will make the crackling of your lips even faster. And you patchiness, mapupunta siya agad sa teeth mo. Ganun siya pa pangit. May tinga ka agad dito. Don't like it. Don't like it so much. This lipstick though, I don't like it. I'm not a big fan of this lipstick. No. No. Don't give me Colourpop for Christmas. You can give me their other stuff. But no. Not the liquid lipsticks, please. Please. Sayang kasi ang ganda talaga ng color eh. Pero yun lang, yun lang yung pagbe-brittle, yung nagka-crack, napupunta yung little brittle bits sa teeth ko. Ayoko ng hassle na ganyan. Ayan guys, so natapos na din tayo sa pagsuswatch and review ng nude lipis ko. Please do tell me if my same experiences pa tayo, if may plan pa kayo magbumili ng mga products na binanggit ko, if gusto niyo manalo ng next products kasi ma super matagal na tong giveaway na to. Gusto ko na talagang ipamigay tong next products na to kasi naka nandiyan lang siya sa corner ng room ko. Um, I really want to give this away to a very deserving person. So if you want to win that next goodies, then please, please, mag subscribe kayo sa YouTube account ko, and also follow me on my Instagram account, which is at makeupaybuya. The rest of the giveaway instructions are in the description box below. Again, guys, if you like this video, please do give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, share this video, and if you have any comments, suggestions, anything, opinions, thoughts, please do comment it down below. Again, just remember, no hate, just love. Anything. It has been a. It has been. <laughs> Sana hindi magbago isip sa akin about to lose.